Good day to you all. Welcome back to our channel and I hope you're going to learn something today. So today our topic will be real and make-believe images. So you know you see and watch videos, images, you see lots of happenings every day around you and these are just part of our lives. But there are two types of images that we see every day and that is real images and they're also images that are make-believe or we find it hard to believe that it is uh, real all right so stay tuned if you are not yet a subscriber to this channel please subscribe so that you'll be you'll get notified of the fresh videos that i'm going to upload soon okay all right so here is our topic real and make-believe images All right, so by the end of this uh, by the end of this lesson you should be able to identify images that are real and images that are make believe or unreal all right so <clears throat> now learn real images are images that portray real life happenings and existence how about the make believe images these are images that portray unreal or imaginative happenings and existence okay so everything that you see is an image whether it's moving or not Okay, what the? <laughs> Do you think that's real or unreal? Uh, though really kids like that age or infants like those dance as if they're adults like that. Do you believe it? Is it real or make-believe? Comment your answer below. Write it. Type it. Comment your answer below. Let's see if you can distinguish uh, the real images and unreal images from the video. So I'm going to uh, show you. So watch the following videos and can you tell which is real and I've been looking forward to this. Let's take them. Look at the fools. There is no escape. Ah. Oh, is it real or unreal? The cars really transform into robots? Do you see that every day? Of course, it's unreal. It's only a product of imagination. Perhaps this one is inspired from the movie Transformers. Next. All right, so that's a volcano spewing ashes. What do you think? Is it real or unreal? Of course, that's real. There are many volcanoes in the Philippines, especially Mount Pinatubo and Mount Mayon. That one looks like My Mount Mayon. I don't know if it, that's Mount Mayon itself because there are many cone-shaped volcanoes found everywhere, anywhere in the world. Next image, we have this. So the, I, I see lots of that kind of houses here in the Philippines, especially those uh, illegal settlers. All right, so is it real? It's real, of course. Next. It is now the very last day. How should I pursue my way? Do, do cats really dance and sing like that? Of course, that is unreal. Next. Hmm. Okay, there's a kid, a beautiful girl reading geography book. Real 
or unreal i bet you also read your book right so that is real of course so what is a real image real image is an image that you can see in real life so whenever you wake up and you experience you see images that you see every day uh, that is a real image just like you know making coffee making milk drinking milk uh, watching the birds around, flying, things like that. Okay, how about that? This is an example of a real image. Do you see a dog biting his football? Of course, that's real. Sometimes dogs become so playful that they bite just everything, including your foot. Okay, next. How about that? Is that a tree? Yes, that's a tree. Uh, I don't know what they call that, but it's a mother tree. It's a very, very old tree. It has many branches like that. And you can find that in the forest. Okay, next we have here the bird standing on the ground with lots of garbages. Is that image real? Yes, it is real. You know, because, uh, because the earth is having so many people. And these people will create garbages. These garbages would, uh, would go anywhere, and that is real, you know? It's making a mess with our environment. Next is this. A volcano spewing lava. Is that real or unreal? What's your answer? Comment your answer below. Yes, that is, of course, it's a real image because we're talking about real images. How about a child? Uh... Riding a bike, motorbike, a dirt bike. Is it real or unreal? Yes, it's an image that is real because, you know, children, uh, who, especially those who have uh, parents who are inclined to sports like that, also prefer to use that sport for them. Okay, so what is a make-believe image? A make-believe image is an image that is fictive or unreal. Okay, so this image is mostly fiction or product of imagination that we see and watch every day. Okay, so let's have some examples. Uh, look at this. This one is a baby, but it ha or she has a face of an old man. To be exact, it's Mr. Bean. Do you know Mr. Bean? An old man that doesn't speak, that do funny things. That's Mr. Bean. Okay, so somebody has just may combine the images the face of mr bean and the image of a baby and then edited it in the photoshop and that's the result you know funny face funny baby face all right next hmm avengers we have captain america there in the center we have black widow there and we have what's that anyway in real life, we don't see them wearing suits like that, costumes like that. We don't see, um, we only see normal people with normal shirts and normal power, you know. <laughs> we don't see people with superpower. This is a product of, of a cinematographer's uh, creative imagination and making it a movie to entertain us. Next, we have Tom and Jerry. So we have the cat and a mouse chasing each other and making fool of each other that's just a drawing and an animator made it make make the drawing move as if they're living next we have a book come on do you see really a book flying a huge book where you can go on top of it and fly like a bird nah it's not real next Mobile Legends. Who play Mobile Legends? No, I don't. You, you play with it. <laughs> but it's just an unreal image. Okay, so there are many real and real images examples around, but we can, of course, we cannot put them all here in our lesson in our because we have only limited time. All right, so let's see if you can now identify real image versus. The make-believe one. Are you ready? Let's do it. All right. <clears throat> Tell whether the following image is real or make-believe. How about that? I bet we experience that every day, yeah? Or 
perhaps uh, during the rainy season of course it is real is your answer correct have you already written it in the comment section write it next Superman, is he real or unreal? Mm. Superman is not real. Okay, next. How about this? This is called an editorial cartoon. And editorial cartoons usually are over, you know, they portray a message that is related to the current issues. That is not, it's only make believe. Next, we have a car, BMW Red, but it transforms into a robot. Can you, do you see that every day? Do you see cars transform in a robot or bicycles transform into a, an airplane? No, it's a make-believe. Next, wow, beautiful sunset. I wish I could have a house on the shore. And watch this one every end of the day. How rewarding, isn't it? Is this a real image or a make-believe one? It's real, of course. Next, in summary, ladies and gentlemen, always remember that we see real and make-believe images every day. Okay? Recognizing between the two would enable you to respond accordingly. Real images are those that you see in real life, and they those images are true. Make-believe images are the ones that are only products of imagination, and sometimes we find it hard to believe them because they are really make-believe. They tend to make you believe because they're not really real. Next. Alright, so we have reached the final chapter of our lesson evaluation. You have to test yourself. Get yourself paper and pen, please. Write down your answer on a pen of paper and uh, uh, let's check later if your answers are correct. Or you can just type your answer in the comment section of this video there at the bottom. So r just write your answer on the comment section. It will be fine. At least you have something to do to interact with me. Okay, so <clears throat> tell whether the following image is real or make-believe. What's that? All right, write your answer now. Type your answer. The correct answer is real. Of course, that's real. That's no place. How about that? Ah, Lamborghini. Hmm. I wish I could have a car like that later. All right, so that is, of course, real. People who are very rich buy those kinds of things. Next, hmm, what is that? Let's watch it and see what will be the result. Okay, so that's the way they make glass. See, you're already looking at the finished product. Okay, that's real. Next is we have a what? Pig. <laughs> Hmm. Is that real or unreal? Of course, it is real. Okay, next. Oh, what's that? Somebody peeing? No, it's just a, just, just a fountain with a very playful idea of making it a person is peeing now. But it's only, it's only a fountain. It's real, actually. Okay, next, so find the real images implied by the following. Okay, which is real? That's the question. Cat singing happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. B, a very loud thunder. And C, smoke belching, which is real. Hmm, you can have more than one answer. And the correct answer is... There you go. We have B and C. A very loud thunder. Of course, we hear it during raining. Uh, when it's raining and smoke belching, we see that on the streets. Cars with very, very uh, black or blue or very thick smoke. 
Next, which is real? A. Transparent leaves. Transparent leaves. Hmm. Blue whale. Red bird. Oh, which of those is real? You can have one or more answer. Okay, so these are real. Blue whale, yes, it exists. Red bird, yes, I saw one. And the transparent leaves, I don't think so, it exists. Next, which is unreal? We have a piglet happy to be roasted. <laughs> and Superstorm. And we also have bread and butter. Okay, so B and C. That's the right answer. Next. Which is a make-believe? Now, this time we're going to look for the make-believe ones. Infant dancing like a professional. Hmm. Baby boss movie. Hmm. Brown rice. The correct answer is... A and B. Alright, which is make-believe? A. You still become successful even if you don't study at all. COVID is lethal disease. And playing in the rain might cause fever. What do you think? Okay, letter A. You gotta study well so that you will become successful someday. For your assignment, you can find more exercises in, in the internet about this topic. If you still are not satisfied with the lesson today, you can just browse the internet. There are many more lessons for you. It's now raining hard, so I have to close this video. I hope, I pray that you have learned something from me today. Have a great day.